Since January 1 of this year, we have a 30% reduction in non-fatal heroin overdose in Nassau County. In the raging opioid epidemic, that is progress. The first decrease in five years in Nassau County, with fatal overdoses also down 11%. Nassau police credit a new approach dubbed Operation Natalie, named after Victor Chiapa's daughter. Her death exposed the horror of heroin addiction, which was in our backyards, and none of us knew it. 18-year-old Natalie Chiapa became the face of the heroin epidemic when 10 years ago, she was found unresponsive on a friend's garage couch the morning after a party. Her parents have spent a decade trying to stem an ever-worsening crisis until now. You can see more arrests are being made, less overdoses, less fatalities. Sadly, it's come at a cost of kids dying, but uh, I finally can say I believe in the system now. What's changed? Operation Natalie focuses on one hot spot at a time. Its seventh this year is now Valley Stream, where police map drug overdoses with auto larcenies to target enforcement and outreach. A lot of the auto larcenies are drug related. People are stealing cars or stealing things from cars to support their drug habit. Their five prong approach, they say, understands addiction is a disease. We go back to the residents of those people who have overdosed a week later. We make sure that they're getting the resources that they need. An approach bolstered by diversion court, an arm of the court system which has helped hundreds of defendants get clean without imprisonment. Drug treatment counselors say they do detect a possible turning point. I think we're, I think we're making some headway. I really do. And police remind parents if they find drugs on their children that they cannot identify they can bring them for free testing to any police precinct station house, an option that may have saved Natalie's life. In Mineola, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. August 9th, police will hold a community forum in Valley Stream to follow up on Operation Natalie, and they encourage young adults to attend.